NBC Bears Robert Honda joins us live from downtown San Jose after hearing an encouraging update on the pandemic from Santa Clara County's public health officer. Robert, Sarah Cody has really uh, is the face so much of this pandemic in terms of the Bay Area. Yeah, she really has been the face of uh, the information that we're getting from there. And fortunately for us today, a lot of it was encouraging. And it would take a lot to stop people here in downtown San Jose from celebrating St. Patrick's Day. And uh, she didn't say anything that would stop the party. But for a lot of businesses that had to survive the past two years, they want to see a lot more green first. While many people are celebrating St. Patrick's Day, Lana Vo is just happy to still be in business today. Her family opened the popular boutique Dandelion on Lincoln Avenue in Willow Glen two months before the county's shelter-in-place order went into effect. It was really tough for the past couple of years, especially the first year. We were trying to survive day by day. We didn't think we were going to make it, but we were lucky that we got some assistance from the government to pay for expenses and other things around. Other neighboring businesses weren't so fortunate. Many closed their doors two years ago and never reopened or couldn't recover. But in terms of human life, public health officer Dr. Sarah Cody said the community's collective effort in taking precautions compared to death rates in other parts of the state has saved about 2,000 lives. But, and there's always a but, um, we still are in the middle of a worldwide pandemic. And even though many messages out there are, you know, we're, we're moving on, um, the virus hasn't moved on. Lana Vo agrees, but says she's encouraged. I've had customers who come in and said, you know, I haven't been wearing anything new for the past year, 18 months. So I need something new to wear. So that's a good sign. So on both fronts, we still need to wait longer than the two years to see if we ever fully recover. Businesses still need to keep customers coming in, and people still need to take precautions, especially when they get together to celebrate. Live in downtown San Jose, Robert Honda, NBC Bay Area News.